Hi everybody, it's your pharmacist Sunki here. Today we are going to be talking about types of food that contains vitamin D. Sunki. This channel is dedicated to better your health. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, hit the subscribe button now and thumbs up. Without further ado, let's rock it. Vitamin D is a fat-soluble vitamin, which is an essential steroid hormone that is very important to help the absorption of calcium into our body to keep our muscles and bones strong and healthy. Vitamin D is made in our skin upon the exposure of sunlight UVB radiation. I talk more about vitamin D on my other videos, how it works, how much you need, why it is so important. I'll put all the links down below for you so you can check them out later. In this video, we're going to be focusing on the types of food that contains vitamin D. There are two forms of vitamin D, vitamin D2 ergocalciferol and vitamin D3 cholecalciferol. Vitamin D2 mainly comes from plant source and fortified foods. Fortified food means that the food itself does not naturally contain the nutrients but is then manually added later. Now vitamin D2 is cheaper to manufacture, that's why fortified foods uses vitamin D2. Vitamin D3 is only found in animal-based food sources. The vitamin D that is manufactured in our skin after exposure of sunlight is vitamin D3. Now, research suggests that vitamin D2 is less effective in raising our vitamin D in the blood levels as compared to vitamin D3. List of foods that contain vitamin D. Cod liver oil. Besides containing vitamin D, it also contains vitamin A and omega-3 fatty acids. Now, if you are pregnant or might be pregnant, do not consume any cod liver oil because of its vitamin A content. Over consuming vitamin A in pregnant ladies can cause birth defects to the baby. Now, if you decide to go to the pharmacy and get yourself some cod liver oil, make sure you talk to the pharmacist to rule out any conditions that you have got where you aren't supposed to take any cod liver oil. And check with the pharmacist to, to make sure that none of the medication that you are taking interacts with cod liver oil. Cooked farmed rainbow trout. Now the reason I say farmed fish here is so that we rule out any contamination risk where we do not know where the fish source comes from. Many fish are good sources of vitamin D. So another good source of vitamin D is the sock eye salmon, also known as red salmon, kokani salmon, or the blue back salmon. Now remember to always cook all your fish properly. I know raw fish, raw salmon, sushi, Japanese style is very, very tempting for many people to me as well, but there is a risk of getting infections in eating raw meat. And in severe cases, it can mean amputation of your limbs and death. Sardines and tuna has vitamin D as well, but their levels will be significantly lower than trout and salmon. White mushrooms that were exposed to UV light. When mushrooms are exposed to UV light, it makes vitamin D. So while it is discouraged that we sunbake ourselves because of skin cancer risk, Sun baking our mushrooms is helpful to boost its vitamin D levels. Remember, the vitamin D content decreases as storage time gets longer. So eat your mushroom cooked before it's best before date. Portobello mushrooms contains vitamin D as well, but it has less vitamin D as compared to white mushrooms. The reason behind this, I believe it's because of its darker skin. It's same as human beings. People with darker skin has high levels of melanin, thus reduces the exposure of sunlight to the skin to manufacture vitamin D. Eggs. The egg yolk contains vitamin D. Remember to cook your eggs properly as well. Eating raw eggs increases the risk of microbe infections, such as salmonella infections. Vitamin D fortified milk. This includes cow's milk, soy, almond, and oat's milk. Milk does not naturally come with vitamin D. It naturally comes with calcium, but we need the vitamin D to help calcium to absorb into our body. So if we are vitamin D deficient, no matter how much calcium there are in the milk, it will not get absorbed 
properly. So if the milk is fortified with vitamin D, it will be stated clearly on the label. So a quick quiz, does ice cream contain vitamin D? The answer to that is if the ice cream is made up of vitamin D fortified milk, then it contains vitamin D. If the ice cream is not made out of fortified vitamin D milk, then it does not contain vitamin D. Besides milk, there are many other foods that have fortified vitamin D, such as orange juices and cereals. And it should all be labeled properly on the packaging. Beef liver. Now, if you are pregnant or likely to be pregnant, do not consume any beef liver because besides the vitamin D, it also contains vitamin A, which when over consumed can cause birth defects. Cheddar cheese and chicken breast also contains vitamin D. There you go, these are the list of vitamin D containing foods. I've also made other videos about vitamin D. I will put all the links down below. Some of the topics includes vitamin D and the immune system and why it is very important for us to have enough vitamin D, especially at this climate. I hope this video is of value to you. Please do share it with your friends and family so they could benefit from it too. Now, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, hit the subscribe button now and thumbs up and also follow me on Facebook and Instagram. My handle is at Official. It's your pharmacist Sunki here with lots of love. See you around.